Sensory Spaces as a program of uh, three exhibitions a year, solidly dedicated to contemporary art happening in one singular space, which is um, the Villa van der Vroom uh, room, which we have in our back. Our aim is to invite uh, artists which are in a crucial moment of their career. They're still defined maybe as young artists, but at the same time they're experienced enough. For the first exhibition in the series, we invited the American artist Oscar Tozon. Oscar's work attempt to change roots with the very simple ideas, very simple, um, I would say, rotations of point of view. I'm Oscar Toisan. I'm an artist. <laughs> My interest in building things, it's in the process of building things. It's in the, uh, the physical process of constructing something rather than in design, really. So the things that I feel interested in and inspired by are, are normally people who build their own house and the struggles and mistakes and imperfections of that process. 1298. The work I do continues from the work I've done, but when I come into a space, I, I keep it as open as possible and then let the space inform the work. There's some kind of push and pull between the space and the work and that process of figuring out the limits, figuring out the possibilities ultimately forms what the, the work will be. This installation, which has been commissioned by the museum, is built from seven modules, which are used as doors and are in interchange of spaces. Each door is a junction between two rooms. Sensory Spaces is located in an open area of the museum, so the public is allowed to freely come in and out uh, the building and, uh, and this series of exhibitions. What we, we found uh, interesting is that um, this work specifically, but in uh, general terms this series, addresses directly to the public, addresses to the experience of the public in being in a, in a space. So visitors following the series will be caught by notions of surprise and transformation and how a determined uh, giving 250 square meters room can be transformed just by simple use of lines and planes.